We understand the power of prayer. We understand the power of love, and we understand the power of hard work and doing something. Prayer gathering with an unusual purpose. The members of Confront and Conquer know both the challenge and blessing of raising special needs children. The 10-year-old support group started by Eileen Lumar Johnson, now a church pastor. She says her heart ached when she saw the children affected by the Zika virus. I wept when I saw those beautiful babies and what they would have to deal with. To sit here and watch this happen and not try to do something about it, it's just not right. So they are doing something, both providential and practical. Certainly fervent prayer, but beyond that, collecting insect repellent to send to Brazil to help protect pregnant mothers and unborn children from Zika. You wouldn't think something that simple would save someone's life or someone just thinking about, oh, someone else cares about me and loves and supports me. If God sent you to give me that can of spray, what else can God send through you to me? You know, so to be a part of that is like awesome. The push is on to collect cans of insect repellent, a gift from families who understand both the power of prayer and the challenge that Zika victims will face. But know that someone's praying with you and praying over your child, um, it makes a difference, a, a tremendous difference. Because we know what these families are going to have to deal with. Um, and we understand they're going to need the same kind of therapies. Uh, and they may not have the resources. They may not have somebody that they can cry with or pray with or that they can have faith with. Protection comes in many forms. Operation Confront and Conquer, collecting something so simple as mosquito repellent to protect faraway families with whom they have a bond and a chance to change their lives for the better. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Heath Allen, WDSU News.